Alright everybody, what is going on? Welcome back to another video. Today's video, we're back. We're back with another fan starter pack. I don't know what it, what it is. You guys know what it is from the title, but I don't. I'm about to find out. It's from a man. Regardless of that, it's about time we opened it. He, he's dropped a cool $67 US on just sending this, regardless of what's inside it. So I want to say, mate, before anything else, you know, I, I, I do feel in a little bit of an awkward situation sometimes, especially when I see a price like that on a little box like this. I'm like, geez, man. Sorry. <laughs> sorry, sorry I live so, so far away. Sorry it costs so much to send, but honestly, man, I appreciate it so much. My audience appreciates it. And so, let's crack into it. Now, as always, if there is a letter in there, I'm going to leave it till the end. I'm going to open up everything, give my first initial reactions, and then read the letter afterwards. If I can get into this thing. There we go. Result. Grey and red. I love it. <laughs> oh yes. Look at this. All right. Oh shit. What's this? Oh, that is freaking awesome, man. Look at this. <laughs> Ohio Bobcats. But it's a um, it's a uh, like a, a team like coaches jersey thing. Fuck, that's that's sick, man. That is awesome. I haven't had one of these in ages. Usually I'd get a hoodie or a crew neck jumper. I haven't had like a, a collared zip up sort of, uh, what do you call it? Jersey. <laughs> Coach's jersey? I don't know what you call this. But it's awesome. Thank you, man. Ohio Bobcats. Sick. So I assume that's not the Ohio Buckeyes. I assume. Oh, mate. We got a full tracksuit. <laughs> where's my where's my helmet? Where's my jumper, mate? Get me on the field. That is awesome, man. Ohio University was created in 1804. Are you fucking joking me? The first four ships arrived in Christchurch in 1850. Bloody Ohio Bobcats had already been gone for 50 years before anyone even inhabited my hometown. Okay. Well, I better put them on. Just a sec. Nick Minnett. Oh. Yeah. Mint. Oh, actually, you know what? No, I think there's a t-shirt, so better wait. And this is what I saw first. And this is... This is mint, man. I fucking love this top. The colours. The team. Boom! I love it! I absolutely love it, man. That is so awesome. I love these like college style prints. Especially in grey and red. I really like that. Is that the Buckeyes though? Who are... Who are the Bobcats? And who are the Buckeyes? I'm confused right now. Okay? But we do have a letter. So I'll get on to that. What's this? Sacred beads! <gasps> okay, alright. I'm assuming I'll be told what these are. These look like, uh, what are those, what are those, what are those nuts? They look like Hazelnuts. Is that, is that what they are? I don't know. <laughs> oh, mate, you've got a hat too. And my man has us a strap back. 
And actually, you know what just came to mind, guys? I just thought, fuck, I can't put this hat on because I've got all this hair on my head. It's going to go everywhere. But I'll tell you what, it feels so good, so amazingly good to have no hair on my head so I can just put this straight on. <laughs> well, maybe not. Maybe not straight on. But at least there's no hair underneath to ruin it. Oh yeah, we're getting there. We're getting there. Okay, flag. Flag time. We've got some stars. Some stars and stripes. Or maybe... Um... What kind of flag is this, guys? Because I'm actually not sure. Looks like Cuba or something. Okay. Right. This t-shirt I am absolutely in love with. I freaking love this thing, man. This is awesome. Definitely giving me some uh, inspiration for, for colorways for my own clothing brand. Definitely. Everything I see, as far as colors, as far as clothes, designs, fabric types, everything, I'm always thinking, oh, I could do that, oh, we could make that, that looks cool, I'll take that part from that and put it on there, you know, I'm always thinking like that, so, stay tuned to Major Key Physiques, because we're going to be bringing out some awesome shit very soon, but in the meantime, I'm a part of the Ohio Bobcats, put the hat on, Put the beads on. <clears throat> Drape myself in the, uh, the, the, the the flag, as always. <laughs> and let's let's read this letter. Oh, we got a book. We've got a book. We've got two books. Huh? The game. The Michigan-Ohio State football rivalry. Images of sports. With a history that stretches over a century, the Michigan-Ohio State rivalry is one of the oldest in college football. The two teams claim a combined 19 national championships, hundreds of All-Americans, and 10 Heisman trophies. Each year, millions of Buckeye and Wolverine fans watch the two teams battle for an opportunity to win the Big Ten Championship in a contest simply known as the game. A portion of this book's proceeds will benefit the Ken McGee Foundation for Cops, which assists police officers permanently injured in the line of duty. Look at that. I'm definitely going to have some fun looking through that. And the second book is this one. The Hundred Yard War. The Hundred Yard. <clears throat> Inside the hundred year old Michigan Ohio State football rivalry. ESPN called it the number one sports rivalry of the century. Wow. It transcends the years, the standings, and all other distractions. And thanks to the countless remarkable football games between Michigan and Ohio State, and hundreds of thousands of devoted alumni, 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 and hundreds of thousands of devoted fans and followers, the rivalry is now an enormous cultural event. Emmanuel does a marvellous job of conveying not only the competition between the athletes, but the less than ideal game conditions, the spirit of the marching bands, and in particular the loyalty of classmates and family that go into making this a special competition. Ohio State. Alright, here we go. Okay, big letter. You ready guys? You ready? Let's do this. Dear Jacob, I'm a big fan of your reaction videos on YouTube. 
I support your adventure in learning all you can about the NFL, the league's history, and learning the rules and players that make this game so special. With that said, I would urge you to delve into the world of college football. Well, I have recently, so I hope you're happy, man. I hope, I hope you've been enjoying these videos I've been doing lately. As that predates professional football by more than half a century, in fact, the largest football stadiums in the country are all college football stadiums. I did know that. That's insane. And Ohio Stadium, as well as Michigan, Beaver Stadium, are just a few stadiums that have a capacity of more than 100,000 people. Many Saturday afternoons, college football stadiums can become larger than most cities in a state. That is fucking insane. <laughs> that being said, I thought you'd be interested in understanding one of the biggest, if not the biggest, in terms of population, college football rivalries. Ohio State Buckeyes versus the Michigan Wolverines. The teams hate each other. The animosity actually predates college football. When Michigan wanted to become a state, they wanted the city of Toledo, which sits on the western banks of Lake Erie. Ohio, already a state at the time, claimed the city within its northern border. Armed militias, militia, militias gathered on both sides of the disputed border and shots were fired. In the end, the United States Congress gave Toledo to Ohio and Michigan got their entire upper peninsula. There has been bad blood ever since. I am from Ohio, so naturally I support the Ohio State Buckeyes, especially during Michigan Week. I have included some books for you to read. An Ohio State hat, shirt, and a necklace made of Buckeyes. The Buckeye is a state tree of Ohio. The nuts resemble the eye of a buck or deer. That's how it got, it, that's how it got its name. Please note the nuts are slightly poisonous and shouldn't be eaten. <laughs> Alright, I better not give this to my, my daughter. <clears throat> they can make a person sick. They are safe to touch, display, handle. I know you have a small child, so be careful as to lot, not let her put the necklace in her mouth. Good thinking, buddy. We're on the same, same wavelength there. I've also included some Ohio University gear. I went to Ohio University for my undergraduate degree. They are known as the, the Ohio Bobcats. Ohio University is the oldest university in the state. I was in the marching band there and loved playing at the games. Okay, so there's Ohio State, Ohio State University, and Ohio University. Lastly, I've included the, the state of Ohio flag. The cool thing about the, <coughs> sorry, the cool thing about the Ohio flag is its shape. We're the only state in the union to have a flag shaped as a pennant and not a rectangle. Well, I did realize that. It's weird. My only request for you is to react to the video Michigan vs Ohio State The Rivalry which can be found on YouTube. This roughly hour long video <laughs> explains the rivalry thoroughly and it is quite a pleasure to watch. Also you might enjoy seeing a college marching band since that's what's typically on the field during half time of a football game. My, old, my alma mater's band, my alma mater's band is known as the Marching 110. They typically play popular music and they dance. My suggested viewings are searching on YouTube, Party Rock Anthem, Gangnam Style, or What Does the Fox Say? Lastly, if you're ever in America, I'd gladly take you to an Ohio or Ohio State game, and we could also visit the National Football Hall of Fame, which of course is in Ohio. Go Bobcats, go Buckeyes. What a fucking legend. That's all I've got to say. So guys, you know what man, I'm gonna, I'm gonna take these off just for now. Honestly man, thank god I don't have my hair on my head. Seriously, like I'd be pulling this off, it'd go everywhere. I'd be like pulling it back, I'd have to, you know, redo it. It's just, it was all in my eyes. Ah, I feel so free, I feel so good. Really does, honestly. For those of you worrying that I'd be depressed about it, nah, I'm not. It's fine. If I want to tie it back, it's a year worth of growth and I've got it. So anyways, I'm going to get my flag shaped as a pennant, even though I don't, want to, I don't know what a pennant is. That's cool. Um, but no man, I, 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 I really love this t-shirt. If I didn't say it before enough, I do. So thank you. So uh, I want to say once again thank you. It was absolutely phenomenal. I'm pretty sure that this is going to be a thumbnail. So we're going to go like this.
and possibly turn the cap round actually. Yeah, here we go. <laughs> I'm just having so much fun doing these man, honestly. <sighs> like I keep putting in my description box, okay? All I want you guys to do is to get something positive out of my content. It's not about paying my bills with the revenue. It's about providing positivity and having fun. And that's what I'm doing. So once again, thank you for the package, man. It's absolutely insane. The next video is going to be a reaction. Ohio State vs. Michigan. I don't know if I'm going to be able to do the hour-long video. Okay? I, 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 can I? Should I? Fuck, he probably spent like over 300 bucks on me. He's probably spent shitloads, actually. You know what? Fuck it, I will. It's going to be the longest video I've ever done. We're going to watch a 60-minute special on Ohio State vs. Michigan. And I want to welcome you to that video. So stay tuned. If you have liked this one, please press like. If you want to subscribe, that's even better. And I'll see you guys in the next one.